Okay. We got four herbal leaves from that. So the garden is a pie up top? Uh, no, not yet. It's going to be, but right now it's uh, just in the little hydroponics area. That's still blocked off. Okay. Yeah, it's just right here for now. So when you want to expand it, you'll put it up there, I guess. Yeah, what I, what I might end up doing is having this down here be nothing but herbal leaves. And then having all the other stuff up above. There's a... There's a... POI we can get that has tons and tons of planters. Of grow plots, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, I guess for now, let's go ahead. I wonder if we should worry about that now, or if I should start working well, do we have on... Any... Well, can we place a couple turrets on, on, these, on the base? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking we should do. Um, That'll be quick and easy. I probably already have some already made up or found salvaged from something uh the only ones we had were were capital vessel ones that are on okay. the capital vessel um you're gonna have to learn and make some base ones unless we want to just use the basic uh large junk turrets that i can make now uh the range on those won't work the hv ones i don't know no they're uh if you look at the uh salvaging anybody can learn them the large junk cannon has a uh, space range of 625. So they'll provide some defense against uh, against space drones. And their ammunition just requires uh, steel plates, which we have a lot of. Yeah. Or we did. I don't know if we still do. We have a decent amount, not as much as we used to. I mean, but if you've already unlocked some actual turrets, we might as well use those. I don't know where they are. I don't know what class or what. I'm not. Um, I'm not seeing it other than for the CV. Um, Engineering doesn't have anything. It's under. Just Yeah, vehicle combat. For a base. I, I mean, I didn't know what else <laughs> to put it under. Okay. But if you see the sentry guns to the right of it are the base turrets. Okay, I found him. Um, really, we're just going to need minigun turrets on here to deal with drones, and that's probably it. Maybe a cannon turret. Okay. Got them. I got the ammo box, some sentry guns, and the uh, projectile turrets on lock. All right. I can do um, rockets. I can, do, I can go all the way, pretty much. Yeah, because it only goes with level 20 for the weapons. So do we need an ammo box too? We, we, have one? we are going to need an ammo box. I we'll, uh, just want to put it in the storage area in the uh, cargo bay. Okay, we don't have we don't already have one laying around, do we? We might. I mean, all we need is if we have one of the green two by one ones. And what kind of ammo? You want to just do regular 15? Um, if we're doing miniguns, let's do... If, if, if we're doing the projectile ones, let's do 15 and 30. Okay. We'll do both. I, I crafted two, so we can do both. Okay. Um, um, there's one more minigun turret on that we have here that we can put on the ship. Uh, we do not have an ammo box, so that's something we're going to have to make. 
Just make a regular green one. Um, I don't know how much ammo. Yeah, just make a regular green one for now. I thought we Shit. had one that was laying around. Um, we may have at one point, but I don't think we do. I think it's on the base. Perhaps. Maybe. I don't know. I don't remember. So I got 2,015 mils, and now I'm going to make about the same amount in 30 mil. Somebody can't breathe. Yeah, that's me. I'm a dumbass. I, uh... Took off my helmet. Well, I, I didn't even have my helmet on. It's not. It's funny how you can actually hear someone else's suffering. Right. So this is a person. You're like, yep, I know what you're doing. How does sound travel through space? It doesn't. <laughs> it's like, ah! Oh, different stack sizes. Thirty mil only stacks to fifteen hundred. Yep. But that should compensate to what up, yeah. This is like a hundred extra for the for the uh, thirty mil than the twenty or the two thousand. Alright, everything's built, including the turrets and the ammo and the everything. <sighs> yes, while I'm working Wait. outside I might as well put my environmental suit on. I just want to see where you're going to put him. I suppose you can put him where these radar dishes are. Um, let's see... You're, if you only have two of them... I can make more, but I just made two. Okay. I'm gonna get rid of all the stuff in the middle. What do you want? Retractables, huh? Um, yep. Always. These up here are going to be cannon turrets because they have longer ranges. And that way, um, once we get minigun turrets, I'm going to put them on, put at least, I want at least two minigun turrets on each of the extension extended areas so like two here two on the engineering and two on the habitation and then i'm going to end up wanting four uh cannon turrets on the top up here all right let me craft more turrets then ah. Tried picking something up and it said I could not pick it up because someone was in there. Uh huh, I probably was. Because I usually go into the container and then link back to the constructor. So how many? Try to make two more? Projectiles? Um. If you can make eight more, make eight more. Hmm. Two were made. Making a third. That's the wrong shape. No. What? The grandpa. 
no more great. I'm glad I'm not turning into Gigantor no more. It's funny. I know I was Megantor. I never know you can get Gigantor times two. I have. I wonder if you can get really, really small. Like really, really tiny. Tiny, tiny. I times. have. Not super tiny, just one size down, like half. Not super tiny, like super tiny, tiny. Like, like, Microscopic, can't see you. <laughs> Imagine <laughs> how that happened, like how that would happen in PvP. You got this little guy the size of a roach just running around him. Like, how can you the, There was the shrink ray in, um, in Duke 3D multiplayer. Yo! And then you, and then you step, step over him and squish him. I don't think this will ever happen, though, but imagine Imperion playing this game in VR. Um, I believe they are eventually planning on it. That'd be crazy. You look, you can turn your head, <laughs> it's not turning your whole body. Like, Loop, these, loop this container. Fly your ship like yeah, you actually have to make your arm motion, like your hand motion. Like turn <laughs> your ship. That would slow the game down too. A lot. Hey, you gotta have a. <laughs> you gotta have a BP computer. <laughs> yeah, one of them seven hundred dollar computers. This right here I'm having right here is three three thousand. Yeah. PC. So I wanted the top notch shit, the thing that I could play like without no problems. Like it just plays my graphics good. I mean, if I look into the water, I can see my face, not the character's face, my face. Mm. <laughs> Mark takes on in real life. Yeah. So basically, uh, turn it into a VR, like a actual virtual reality, like a. Uh... Uh, I don't know if you've seen Ready Player One or uh, Sword Art Online. Huh? Sword Art Online is an anime. Ready Player One is a movie. They're about video games. Hmm. Yep. You see, like, now nah, even you know, like a Sword Art Online that uh, they put on this VR helmet and they're like they're yeah. trapped into the game until they beat the game. Well, no, that's, that's just the, because the game designer was a dick. It, it, the few, the, after the first half of the first season, they can log in and out. If we get stuck in the Imperion. <laughs> if you log out, you'll die. Oh, I, hate you that. die. I hate that. You I hate die. that from it. That premise is bugs the fuck out of me. Well, the, well, really, they just removed the logout button and then made it so that if you die in the game, you die in real life. Yeah. Shit, I used to fly my, my, my ship <laughs> in here. And that's only because, like, people people have been known to die when sleeping. Mm -hmm. But how do you know But really because they, they dreamt that they died? Because if they're dead, they can't tell you. Right. <laughs> I have times, I've had a dream where I fell and hit the ground, but I'm fine. And I woke up and fine. But uh, the, the thing is, though, the, the, the game developer in Sword Art Online actually developed the game, designed the, uh, the nerve gear device, so that if their character dies in the game, it delivers a, uh, a lethal shock to the base of their brain, killing them. Yes, I got some, yep. That's a douche move. That's a pretty douchebaggery move. Yes, but he was a big dick, so... I feel bad for that girl that died. Like, they went into this um, room oh, I and it's like, it's all the, I'm like, oh, man. And, and the funny thing is, she was in one episode, but then again, the entire arc took ten episodes. Yeah, she was falling. She was like... It, it took ten episodes to cover two years of content. Hmm. Because every episode skipped several months. He was like, I would not let you die. Well, 
It was because of that guy. He he went in the freaking room, and then all of them went in. Mm -hmm. If he had not be greedy. Um. I don't know Wait. if you know this, but Sword Art Online was actually a series of light novels instead of a manga, and so I. Uh, it's unique as an anime because the writer you know, wrote them as light novels rather than having an artist illustrate everything that was happening. There were there were illustrations in certain areas, but it's interesting. Where is the O2 uh things? The... O2 station? Yeah. There's one on the ship. I I don't think there's one on the station just yet. It's going to end up being in uh, medical. I may end up putting one in medical, one in the cargo area, one in the like one one in almost every area That's of great. the base. But That's good. All right. Let's do this. So confirmed, it's it is confirmed that these iron uh, bearings they spawn back because that one spawned right in my face. Yes, the iron the the nodes I believe do. Yeah, because I was just what? walking down this thing and it just like I I just stood still. I just took a sip of my soda and this thing just went boop. I'm like, what? What spawn back? The iron, you know those iron, like the, like you know those little iron bearings, like iron, copper, them little rock pieces that the you find that, all above. Yeah, that protrude oh, okay. from the surface rocks. Okay. Surface. It just went. I didn't think like, they did. Yeah, it's like because like, I was here for a minute looking in one direction, and I, I just reach over and drink my soda, and this one said, "Whoop!" I'm like, and oh, I mined it. I just, I, and I mined it to see if it's real, and it went ching ching ching. I'm like, oh, okay. maybe it was just a little res. I don't know. Oh no. Okay, I what? put down um I put in a uh air station a O2 station in the sick bay. Okay. There was already a spot for it, I think. It's just there's a corner already out there, so I just put it there. Yeah, you probably put it in the corner I'm gonna end up putting the uh regeneration chamber. And I'm gonna end up putting the oxygen where the medical bay <laughs> is, but it's Freaking fine spider. for now. You still on the planet? Yeah. No, he's fighting space spiders. Oh shit. <laughs> That'd be scary. Freaking space spiders. With jetpacks. What I ought to do is go back to the planet and grab some more um and tax it and refine it. Imagine if they made the Creel space drones look like giant spiders that actually moved and crawled and in the in the in the arms or the legs move and look creepy. Yeah. That'd be cool. <laughs> they already look like snails. Ironically, I haven't actually seen any space drones, uh any Creel space drones yet. Not drones, but they're, C they're uh, CVs. They're CVs, yeah. I think I've seen a couple of their CVs, but I've never seen them with drones. They do have their own drones. I think they just look like the regular drones, though. Yeah. Because even, um, even Polaris have their own drones. Yep, they just look like regular drones, though. 
Okay, I believe I have the command center almost finished. One little area here to fix. Have you guys, like, time to time played uh, vanilla? Um, one of those new, one of those new maps you have in Imperion? Like the, the space, uh, not the space one, the swamp thing, the ice. The ice one is very hard now, they made it hard. They're very, very hard now. I haven't, played, I, know... I haven't played vanilla Imperion in a long while. Because... I only want to play. I only want to play this now when we're all playing together. Quite fun playing with um, uh, uh, you know, with the team instead of playing by yourself. You know, I'm a little burned out playing by myself. So, yeah, it's quite fun playing with friends because you got someone's back to cover. Mm -hmm. And and even though we're galaxies apart right now. <laughs> And the thing is that when you go through these um, these legacy things, you know how they have tunnels? You got somebody watching your back while you go forward. Because sometimes when you go in front, you, these guys spawn right in behind you. Like, yeah. oh, crap, where you come from? Then when one one person shoots while the other one is, you know, what the other one waits. And then, because you know how you shoot, you both shoot at the same time. You both got to reload. And then it gives, them, it gives them, um, the legacy guys time to come close to you and bite you. So after you shoot your round, you say reloading, another person covers you and shoot while you yeah. finish reload. Oh. Sometimes these things come at you at 12 at a time. I'm like, oh boy. Like, let me get this. Reloading. Right. And you shoot. So, let's see what the best design for this would be. Hmm. Because right now I'm trying to figure out where to put the crop plots. Let's do this. I'm going to go ahead and turn these. So if we come up from the middle here, um, let's make a symmetry plane. I don't know if a symmetry plane will work. I think Should be I, fine. Made, really? I think yeah. I was gonna say I think I made this uh, command center symmetrical. Yeah, but it'll be symmetrical to wherever you place the thing, or place your center. Right, but what I'm saying is, I don't know if the pillars in here are symmetrical. Oh yeah, probably not. I think they are, but they're symmetrical specifically to the plane that I put it on here, but not maybe not the other way. I think they are the other way, though. Okay, so... Or you can just clear out all the 
all the pillars. No, I want to leave them for to keep it as Put a uh, well to keep it as a sort of reminder of what this base was, you know. Hmm. Problem is, <laughs> some of the pillars aren't symmetrical. Well, no, they are. It's just they're uh, in the way of three by three gardenings. I think you can probably take some of them out then. Well, hold on. Do you have a specific fridge for medical stuff? Yep, it's in the med station. Okay. It, or med I'm, I'm in the ocean now. and I'm, I'm 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 in one of the ocean, deep oceans and I'm picking up uh, whatever I find, mostly for pentaxid. But I also got some medicinals too, so I'm gonna drop those in there too. Alien plasma, whatever. Alien plasma. Hey, mama. Yeah, it's symmetrical the way I have it, but not the other way, because the other way, there are some pillars that do get in the way of the 3x3 three three garden, and there are some that, and then on the other side, it does not, so. What's this? Oh. Ah! Hey. Hmm, there's a freighter here. Freighter? Yeah, just a Polaris freighter floating around. Too bad we can't ask him to, like, trade with him, because he's a freighter, you know? I know, so, right? Or we can, like, can you, like, we're selling this stuff, can we, like, load it onto your ship and you can go sell it somewhere? It would be nice if they, uh... <laughs> if they, uh, had... Halo trading to it like if they added the added uh added freighters Make that i uh, were also traders yeah you can flag them down they stop and mm -hmm. then they or just communicate with them as you're flying next to them or yeah something. Okay. and then uh polaris can be the ups of of Imperion. <laughs> okay, so... Star Salvager Base, Medical Fridge. There we go. I don't All know right. what you're talking about, Frags. <laughs> Polar oh. Polaris is Amazon. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going back out of the space. I'm back at the station. I'm going to load up the station. The, you mean the planetary station or the orbital station? The the derelict orbital station that we renamed. I forgot. I don't remember what we call it now. Star Salvager Base. Oh, they meant the trade station. Uh, Star orbital. Salvager Base in space instead of the one on the planet. Star Space Voyager, Space Salvager. <laughs> yeah. So now I need to make. I'm in the constructor. I need. Refine the pentaxid. Where is my refined pentaxid? Here it is. Mm -hmm. Alright. I'm going here, to here? put the. Uh... Oh, you sealed Yay, up the whole thing. It's oxygenated! You sealed the whole thing when I was hoping I can just pass through it, but I can't. What do you mean? I'm outside. Oh. Eh. Yeah, no, you have to come inside through one of the actual the doors to way. come in, yeah. Are these all the grow plots you're going to put in? Where it's marked? Yep. Cool. That's a lot. Yep. That's good. Food! Yep. Eat ratatouille all day. 
All day, every day, for days. Actually, where's the fridge, anyway? Cafeteria fridge. Yes, I know stew. All right, I got 38. It would be nice if you if you were able to change the color of your thruster um flame thing that comes out. Yeah, your I know. Mm. That that'd That'd be, be nice. really it, nice it's if up, you could. It's up just for you. Yeah. All the time. So, Kryn and Exana. Where's Exana? So they have it that you can change color lights now. I have like flame, red flaming thrusters. Oh, Some apparently of you might... these sides are not symmetrical either. They're just sort of symmetrical. <laughs> mm. So if I go to Exana for the next thing that I have to find, which moon is it on? Uh, read the read read the thing. It'll tell you. It'll tell me? If you look in your PDA, it'll tell you. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, temperate, eight, oh. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 16. Temperate moon, okay. So I need Temper. 17 times 9 uh, prop plots. We have two at the moment. And there's a bu bunch of them on the other planet. I'm on the thing. Temperate. Which one's temperate? Uh, Usually it's the brown ones. It's usually the gray ones, isn't it? They'll be desolated. Oh, the gray ones are, like, uh, barren moons. There it is. Okay, it's the first one. Alright. Oh, it's, I can't lock into it, apparently. It's too far. I just love the fact that these guys make different kind of galaxies that you can just go to and stuff. Just remember, like, remember it was like mm -hmm. one gal like one solar system? And that's yeah. It. Some people get so to, Pat like... That one I can't get to. It's too far away. So you'll have to find your way there. Oh no! Actually, no, I just—it won't let me warp directly to the moon, but I can still warp to the planet, the gas giant. That's fine. Um, from here, or are you already somewhere else? No, I'm still here. Because just uh, when I when I click on the planet, when I click on the moons, I don't get the option to lock on target. Well, but the, on the on the gas giant, I can. The moon, the the the. It's out of your warp range, I think. Well, you no, are not. using a medium warp, dr medium warp. I should drive, be able to right? warp the entire solar system. Yeah, I should be able to warp the entire solar um, system. The medium, yeah, the medium has a thirty AU. So, from where we are, you still would not be able to get to Vexstar Orntal. No, you should you should be able to go to Vexstar Orntel from Mard Orntel, but there there are some connections you wouldn't be able to do, like from Zasha to Vexstar. I only have thirty anyway, like thirty six. And actually, you might not be able to go from Mard to Vexstar anyway because there's no warp line from here to there. Because if you turn on the warp lines, you can see how far it is from each thing to each thing. There are some things that are denied, like Vexstar to Ooh. Mard. Probably because the sun's in the way. Wait, this planet has no gravity? Which no, one? I'm looking at the wrong thing. The one I'm at. Oh, uh, were you able to go straight to the, uh, to the gas giant from here? 
No, I didn't go to there. I went to Kryn or Tell. Okay, because uh, there's no warp line between Mardor and Tell and the and Exana either. So you would have to go to Kryn first. I don't Kryn see. I don't see. Uh, yeah, warp lines. I can uh, do it from here. But I don't have enough. Um, I don't have enough to get there and back for this one. Heck, I don't think I have enough to go back. Shit, <laughs> eighteen. Looks like you're gonna have to gather. No, I'm okay. I'm okay. I got twenty-one. <laughs> no, I got twenty-one. But I want to know what's the gravity on this planet. Normal, one point one three. I'm okay. Yeah, I was thinking it would yeah, be around normal. It's best normal. to check it that way. Cause yeah, but I every time like... I see a lava planet, I'm thinking, oh crap, the gravity is probably super high. No, the mm -hmm. the only gravity that's super high, if I'm not mistaken, are the nascent lava planets. Uh, okay. I learned the hard way. I'm like, mm -hmm. let me see. I went to the planet. I'm like, wait, why am I being pulled so fast? Yeah, same here. Oh I took my. Uh, what did I take off? I took my capital vessel into the planet's atmosphere, and I crashed, and I couldn't lift off. I was like, ah, oh, damn. I was like, wait, is my thrusters off? <laughs> like, <laughs> I ran out of fuel. What's going on? Okay, so I mean, only... the gravity's higher, but it's not a whole lot. Only three of these projectile turrets after the four that are on top finished. If I could get three more, I don't know if we have the stuff for it, but... We might. I built eight. Or ten. I can't move. Something's wrong. There. What do you mean? I don't know, it just froze. Oh, there's a purpley blue thing here. What's this? Hmm. I think I'm about to encounter a faction we haven't seen yet. Oh, it's Creel. <laughs> Are we... I think we know what... What our... Thing is with Creel. It doesn't say. It still acts like we don't know it. I think it near one of their POIs, I guess. Yeah. One of their POIs or their uh, capital vessels or drones. Yep. yep, they're not shooting at me. There it is. Yep, we're neutral. Oh, this one looks almost looks black. Wait, does that one look black? No, that one looks brighter. Alright, we have the four cannon turrets and three minigun turrets on here right now. No! No, 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 no! I might get shot at! Stop! Come back. What, are the Creole hostile? Uh, no, I was getting... man in mind, but there are... are dr we can't hear here. you. No, I just lost connection. I'm right when I was too. coming into possible hostile territory. Uh, come on. Stop it. Stop it. Ooh, what's this? All right, let me head back to the ship. I found a soul anchor. What the hell is this? Whoa, this is trippy. What's going on? A soul. It's called a soul anchor. I don't even know what faction it is because the text is black. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, our ship ran out of power. Hey, I can throw some of this solar power we made up into the... 
Alvager! I love being able to do that. I mean, it only gave us like 10% power and I used 70 of the uh, battery charges, which was all we had made up, but it's something, you know. So like in real life, solar power is not very efficient. Right, it's not very efficient. It takes a long time to make, but you it's turning from solar energy into, you know, into usable energy. Oh, no. And portable. What's going I think on? I think our base got turned off. What'd you turn the base off for? I, I did not. I was looking in my invent on my uh, blueprint thingy, and I suddenly saw something. Everything turned off. I'm like, what? The base has been on the whole time for me. Huh. Where? So I'm over here he looking. Said at that my... He said that the the CV lost powers. Base is fine. Yeah, I had to turn the CV, put fuel back in on the CV, but. I so have I have to... access to Aerostrium and gold here. Um, where are you? Krill? Kreen? Whatever this planet's called? Um, Kryn Ortel? The red one? The red one. Kryn Ortel. Yep, Kryn Ortel has Zescosium, Aerostrium, Magnesium, and gold. But nope. it's not going to no, have a whole no, lot of it. No, the planet, right now, the planet only has magnesium, erastrium, and gold. Nothing else. Okay, okay. It has the potential to have magnesium, mm -hmm. erastrium, zascosium, and gold. It and has, like... Put a resource now and see what it is. It has, I believe, like, zero to two of any of those. Magnesium. So, maybe it's zero to one of e each of those. I don't remember. Look at your map and see how many of each there are. One of each. Okay. Well, there's, okay, there's one magnesium, there's six erastrium, and one gold. I already found the magnesium. Okay. Where'd it go? Ooh, got a power coil. Dang it. Let me grab some food. Nom 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 dino stew, yeah. Best stuff. Good stuff. Burgers are good too. Eat two burgers and you're full. Mm hmm. The meat ones, okay. not the vegetable burgers. That's what I'm working on. Burgers? So... No, I. Nutrient solutions. I just completely forgot how many of each I'm going to need. Oh, oh, that's the salt anchor. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Three, six, nine, twelve. 15, 17. I counted too many. 17. What is 17 times 9? Math. You're right. That is 100% correct. It is math. <laughs> You're welcome. 153. Say what? 153. 17 times 9, 153. Okay. Turn this off. I don't know if we're going to be able to make that many nutrient solutions. Um, It makes I think three. Go. I'm sure we can salvage all. Well, I'm just looking at it, trying to figure out we might need more. I might need to start putting some water there. So I'm just going to tell this to throw some water over there. Uh-oh. Uh, 
And then we should be good with that once those are made. Kicked out. Got kicked out? Yeah, I got kicked out. Um, we should have... You see, I wish there were a way to, like, dock the capital vessel to the base and then have it so that that because the capital vessel is docked to the base, that it accesses the, uh, that you can access the, uh, whatchamacallum, the containers as if you were in Wi-Fi range, even if you're normal, even if you're not actually. Okay, yeah, you've got fuel in you, so the SS Alvager fuel, I can put fuel in here from the Alvager itself, fill up its fuel tank, that can't go in there. It's full now. Let's see if I fill that up. Okay. Good. That's good. Um, yeah, I'm not even level 20. I can't even make fusion cells yet, which is disappointing. Okay. How many of those has just twenty three? Just twenty three. Okay. Well, for now, let's see if I go ahead and put. Uh, make two more of those. I need elemental pentaxid. That might just be something that I go get. Elemental pentaxid is hard to find. Because you have to pick it up for most of the time. Unless you want to take out a enemy base. We could take out an enemy base. Why am I disconnected? Hello? Hey! You seem to be cutting off, you cut, you cut off connection. Yeah, I noticed. My, for some reason my computer cut out from the Wi-Fi. It looks like it's stable now, but... Can you guys hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. I can hear you. Okay. You should be able to get back into the... Thing. I, I didn't even realize it had cut you out. Yeah. Oh, Frag Light is going to come back. He's going to come back. He has to take care of something. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, 
Okay. Well, I just got the two remaining uh, generators put in the engineering section of our base. So we should be golden. Let me look at the large devices. We should have repair station. We got two repair stations. So I'm going to put one repair station over here in the cargo area, in the storage area. Let's put it there. While we're at it, go ahead and do this and armor lockers. Armor locker. Actually, the armor locker should be able to go in here. I'll probably put a couple more in here. Um, this other repair station, let me put in engineering. Actually, we're not going to need it in engineering. Let's put it... in here. Let's put it in the anger bay if I can. Yeah, right there will be perfect. Okay. Um, the ATM will put one right there. Um... Output. Wanted. Okay. Um. Oh yeah, that's right. I could put a furnace on here somewhere. And eventually I might. But for the time being, we're going to need... Okay. Welcome back. Thank you. Is the server back? Yep, should be. Yeah, I'm not saying it right now. I mean, I, know, I, I just spawn. I mean, I just click on Know It All's icon thing and just. I, I look in the server list of, under friends and it's not showing it. I can do it there. I went to them directly. <laughs> I'm in with them. Let's go there. Let's go to your friends list and click on them and then join game. That's what I'm doing. It takes a couple seconds. Nope. Dang it. Shuffle. Do the shuffle. Smack, 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 smack. Is that no at all right there? Yep. I'm right behind you. Um, all right. I'm going to give us each assigned armor lockers in the... Damn it. Uh, I want to share. Where's my ship? God damn it. What happens to your ship? I don't know. I'm not in my ship, and I'm just out in the middle of the freaking... Thing and I don't see my ship anywhere. 
Um, press that M button and see if you if, if you see a uh, icon mm, of your ship. It's way to my west. Oh my oh. god! Do I have a bike? I have a bike. You can't use a bike in space. I'm not in space. Oh, lucky you. Sheesh. <laughs> I am on that planet looking for stuff. That means your ship probably you probably was flying and you uh you got disconnected. Yeah, I was in the ship flying. I was flying west. And then you got disconnected. That's why. Mm. Okay. Hopefully that ship is not still moving. <laughs> oh my god, there's warlords or whatever they're called. Overlords. Um, oh, one thing that uh, you may not have noticed is that I renamed the container controllers and container controller extensions and container controller ammo and container controller harvest. <sighs> it's now harvest. storage repository, harvest repository, ammo repository, and repository extensions. Why is the gravity on this... Wow. What's up? It's wow gravity? Why is the gravity on in the space station so heavy? What do you mean? Two ships? Huh? Because the ship's gravity is on two? Oh, really? Um, I believe it is. Let me double check. Um, their ship gravity is now off, and you see we can't move. Let me fix that for a second. Um, device... Oh! Oh, oh okay. No, that shouldn't be... I'm jumping regularly okay. out here. I'm jumping regularly, but when you get yeah. inside here, it's heavy as hell. See? I think it's just two grab generators interfering. Um... No, because the one that's closest to the ship right here. Hold on. I'm jumping regularly. Yeah, come over here. Yeah, over here is regular, yep. but over here in the middle is like... And I'll explain why, okay? Come over here, and let me do this real quick. Um, Devices... Okay, now walk over there. Okay. Um, look, I'm floating away. <laughs> That's interesting. They must have uh, expanded the gravity. Really? Um, well, because I have this set up so that the that a sensor would come on so that you would be okay interesting it's just that area and over to here right to here okay that's why I have it here yeah okay no it's fine it's it's uh, because there's two gravity generators on the command center, but and he's experiencing all three. Well, well, only one of them is on most of the time, but I have it set so that the there's a cargo gravity generator that comes on. Um when you enter a specific area in the cargo bay because if it weren't there let me park of gravity because if it weren't there if it didn't come on in certain areas you would be floating Oh, he was floating a second ago and you changed it. 